you guys but i have chills tonight i have been waiting for this moment for a long long time as has the wwe universe finally things are gonna get settled my goosebumps have goosebumps and if yours don't you better check your pulse We thought we might hear from him tonight. Well, things are about to get interesting. He's not going to keep us waiting, so let's find out.
I had a feeling we would start this way. Can't wait for this one. Let's see what he has to say. That blood is a boiling. Gotta respect the effort. Coming off a little cocky right there. Could be dangerous. Bad blood is a boiling. Okay. Definitely a fan favorite. Pride comes before the fall. Better watch it. No love between these superstars, that's for sure. is electric after that. Man, you can't fake passion like that. Well, I'm not sure if we can top that, but we will do our best as we move along with our program. Here we go, and we're kicking things off with a bang. Ah, oh, yeah, it's go time. Oh, man, stay with us because you won't want to miss this. Get ready for the hardware to come out.
With four superstars in action, you've got to keep your eyes peeled, folks. This is gonna be good. The following contest is a tables, ladders, and chairs match. Making his way to the ring from Huntington Beach, California, weighing in at 282 pounds, Samoa Joe. One of the baddest dudes to ever play the game. The first two-time NXT champion. A world-traveled, world-class competitor. One of the most well-rounded athletes sports entertainment's ever encountered. Yeah, the scenery may have changed in Samoa Joe's career, but the attitude is still the same. Samoa Joe does what he wants, when he wants. It's time for our first match of the night, guys, and it looks like we have quite the contest coming up. And good luck to those who have to follow this one. You're going to need it. Guys, what better way to start the night off than with this one? I can't think of a better match to kick the night off, Michael. In fact, we haven't even gotten started yet, and I can assure you that this will be a tough match to follow.
from Mexico City, Mexico, weighing in at 220 pounds, the Bull. Ladies and gentlemen, it is now time for our fatal four-way match. And one of these superstars will walk away from here with plenty to brag about, while the other three will likely be wondering what went wrong for them here tonight. The four men in the ring are set. One of the most chaotic contests a superstar can compete in is a fatal four-way. Anything can happen, and the match can be over in an instant. Oh, oh, oh man! <laughs> oh, what a right! Yeah, that's an attitude behind it. WrestleMania in Orlando, Florida. The Raw Tag Team Championship was decided in a fatal four-way ladder match. It was champions Anderson and Gallows, Cesaro and Sheamus, Enzo and Cass, and for the first time in seven years at WrestleMania, the Hardy Boys. I couldn't believe what I saw when the bell rang. What's he doing? Oh, a knee right to the face. That knee is a lethal weapon. Corey, the fatal four-way tag match at WrestleMania was one of the most anticipated contests on the card. The Hardy Boys shocked the world when they returned to the grandest stage of the ball. Once they displayed their trademark continuity, it was like they never left. But Gallows and Anderson were not giving away the title. The teams were in top form and were not afraid to use steel ladders to their advantage. Cesaro and Sheamus dominated the field with their power. But when Jeff Hardy performed his swanton bomb off the top of the ladder, it crushed Cesaro and gave brother Matt the opening he needed to climb the ladder and win the Raw Tag Team Championship. There is something I've noticed throughout Samoa Joe's career. Something that should make all WWE superstars very cautious. Joe is like an assassin. He targets the competition. Not only with a mission to defeat them, but a mission to destroy them. What a slam! Impactful. Well, jar your spine. He looks a bit off his game here. He's gonna have to be careful. Three guys he's in there with want this match just as much as he does. Byron, you see Samoa Joe having the characteristics of an assassin, carrying the attitude of a merciless mercenary. I question Joe's moral judgment, his lack of sportsmanship. Well, unfortunately, gentlemen, morality doesn't win championships, and you fellas may hate it, but you have no choice but to respect it. Samoa Joe makes no apologies for taking people out because he didn't come to WWE for sportsmanship. He came here to fight. Shows no mercy in that poor chair. It looks like a twisted knee. Suplex! This is what makes him one of the best in the oh, oh, man, inverted backbreaker. Ow! Like 
gives new meaning to have a seat. There he goes, crashing to the floor. Oh, shows no mercy in that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. Whack! Michael, it gives new meaning to have a seat. Uh-oh. When this guy's on, look out. A TLC match is so dangerous that you never want to make a mistake. But being too tentative can also cost you. You saw that at TLC 2016 when AJ Styles defended his WWE World Heavyweight Championship. This is it. Death Valley bomb. This match might be over, guys. Beautiful technique. The 2016 TLC match was the 19th in history, and it would not be for the faint of heart. There was no way to predict which superstar was going to incapacitate his opponent for the climb up the ladder. AJ Styles showed he was more than comfortable battling in TLC's environment of twisted, unforgiving steel and solid wood. Both men had bad intentions, as displayed by AJ Styles when he executed a springboard 450 splash out to the floor. They put Ambrose through a table. That wasn't enough to put Ambrose away, but James Ellsworth pushed Ambrose off the ladder, out of the ring, and through a table. That's how AJ Styles retained his championship. These superstars have tried everything. They have something left in their own Russian leg sweep. Just when you thought he had nothing left. Hulk's impact. damage one person could take. Whoa, ladder hits. Jeez, that's gonna hurt. Oh, and the ladder finds the mark. Gonna be tough to bounce back from that one. These competitors are walking on dangerous ground right now. <laughs> Toss to the outside. Jeez, that's going to hurt. Here comes Samoa Joe. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. <laughs> what a forearm. It's obvious Joe is feeling the pain that's been dealt out so far. And I surprised that he had nothing left at this point. Here's the deal. Him winning this TLC match at this point is about as realistic as me ever caring about what Saxton has to say. Neither are ever going to happen. Period. That killer instinct Samoa Joe has. Probably a back suplex. At this point, guys, I can see any one of these four superstars taking the victory. Oh, shows no mercy in that poor chair. It looks like a twisted heap. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. What is this superstar thinking of a neck breaker? Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. A minor miracle might be needed to overcome this beating. Now he... Uh, Joe is rolling and he doesn't have an answer for him. Oh, wow! Fire! Dirty. Dodges a bullet there. Jeez, 
Oh, that's got to hurt. Oh, the ladder hits. Jeez, that's got to hurt. Oh, the ladder hits. Jeez, that's got to hurt. Jeez, that's gonna hurt. There's gotta be some point in the match where those thoughts start to creep in that it could be over. And then you gotta dig down deep, get rid of the self-doubt, and continue on toward victory. It'll be tough to bounce back from that one. He's making a statement here with this attack. Yeah, okay. The end may be near. Drop kick hits the mark. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? Oh, man. Joe doesn't even know where he is. Got him. Big victory in the fatal four-way. Now let's take a look back at these guys in action. These guys showed flashes in this match, but flashes don't exactly set the world on fire, as these highlights show very well. These guys showed flashes in this match, but flashes don't exactly set the world on fire, as these highlights show very well. Here is your winner, Psycho. And that's a win to start off the night. Yeah, the performance put forth in that match tells me we're looking at somebody who will someday, very soon, be competing in the main event. Believe it or not, that's just the beginning, folks. Stay tuned for more great action. Well, the last match did not disappoint, and now we're on to the next matchup on the card. Singles action on tap right now. We have a great match coming up next. We have one of our breakout talents versus a formidable opponent. Making his way to the ring from California, weighing in at 255 pounds, the male champion, Demon X Champion. Well, I'd say the champ is stepping into the ring tonight with an opposition eager to prove a point. Yeah, but I would say the champ is just as eager to prove a point as well, maybe even more so.
and his opponent from Mexico, weighing in at 150 pounds. And Corey, the what do you think the champ's game plan is for this one? He's going to be champion. looking to end this one as fast as he the can, Cole. The man. longer this match goes, the more chance of injury. And the last thing he wants to do is relinquish his championship due to an injury he sustained in a non-title match. Singles action is underway, and in this one, I wouldn't attempt to predict what's going to happen. I'd just be ready for anything. Sometimes that's all you can do. And man, I never get tired of watching these guys compete. Devastating elbow. Looks like he's starting to sweat now. With these two guys, we all knew this was going to be an all-out battle. I wouldn't call for the medics just yet, Cole. He still appears to be in pretty good shape here. The good news for him is that he doesn't appear to have taken too much offense up to this point, but that can obviously all change here. Second rope driving down. He's talking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. He goes for the cover. One, two, Real nicely done. I can't believe he's in this. Still too fresh. He's not going to like this. This just might be enough for him to take the... There's a pin now. Two. This battle's not over yet. It's going to take more than that. What a stop. Good grief. Drop. Oh, nasty impact. I don't think there's any coming back from this type of assault. There's a good chance he can't recover from this. I can't really tell what his game plan was heading into this match, but whatever it was, it definitely hasn't been working. starting to lose it here. Oh, and he breaks free. But the damage might have already been done, Michael. And now one more time. Slam. This one's over, guys. Just as devastating. He's got the shoulders down. Oh, uh, how resilient was that? He needs to change something fast, guys. Looking for the finish. He, what a clothesline! Ouch! He's got him covered. One, two, three. Yes! Unreal performance. We've got some highlights from the last one queued up here.
Overall, this match was average at best. But not every match is going to be memorable. In fact, I've almost forgotten it happened already. These guys showed flashes in this match, but flashes don't exactly set the world on fire, as these highlights show very well. Ain't nothing better than action like this. Here is your winner, Demon X. A very decisive victory here tonight. And talk about displaying a never-say-die attitude. It was as if winning was the only option here tonight. You got that right, partner. Again, huge win here tonight. Done with one and on to another great matchup. Sit tight for singles action coming up next. Up next, we have singles action. We have one of our breakout talents versus a formidable opponent. Gonna settle the score. Okay, ready for this matchup here tonight. And look at this. Inviting somebody else out here? We have one-on-one -on -one action on the way, and this one should be nothing short of amazing. I don't doubt that for a moment, Michael. In fact, I would go so far as to say this match might just steal the show.
You can feel the electricity Ouch. running through this arena. This is going to be some battle, one-on-one, -on -one, mano a mano. I don't know who's looking more forward to this, the women in the ring or me. Attacking the knee. for a power bomb and that's not a good place to be Cole all the way up and around the world elbow drop big time elbow drop with authority she's taking on some heat this is not how she drew this one up pump the brakes a bit Cole I know exactly what you're thinking and I can tell you with all certainty she still has plenty of gas left in the tank it's been an amazing match up to this point, guys. And from where I sit, any one of these women can win this thing. We know what's coming here. Here we go. The old, oh, 619. Frog splash. Give it five stars. She's in the driver's seat now. You're not going to get her that easy. You have to put in a little more work than that. Here we go. And the slam. Here's her chance. She's staying in this match. She's a warrior, guys. From behind. Down with a neck breaker. Uh, this is dangerous right here. Oof! Look at this! He's got him where he wants it, oh. Beautiful technique. She might have it. What's coming next? Oh, what a slam. And look at, oh, what a slam that hurt. Oh, man, she's rolling now. Setting him up in position here on the second. Long way down. Now that's what I call making. She goes for the quick pin. One, two, three. no kick out. That's too early for that. She's got her in her sights. Here she comes on the counter. We'll see if she can turn things around. She goes for the cover. Wow, that's pure power, guys. Uh, going to the top, high risk. Look out! Impact. She goes for the cover. How did she kick out? Wow, I am impressed. Got the reversal. Hold on, guys. This isn't good. No question about it, Cole. Superplex! Kick out at two! Whoa. That may have been a slow count. I can't believe she kicked out there.
serious damage to the arm being inflicted here. I think she's trying to prove a point here. Look at it a second time. Here we go. The old, oh, 619. Oh, splash. I bet you feel foolish riding her off now. That's how you keep your opponent off balance. Yes, takes it. And look who's here. Look who's here. Why not get the best seat in the house? The best view of what's going on. They're just, just disrespecting Corey. That's all this is about. Mind games, Cole. It'll be tough for the next match to be as good, but we shall see. Don't change that dial. Don't move. We have a great match coming up next. It'll be Los Conquistadors against Los Matadores. Big time matchup. What's this? Well, I think it's about to be a highlight reel. Oh, pounds. and now we have a brawl on our hands. Oh, yeah. They didn't need the match to start to make a point. You gotta believe this one's over. Hooked up. Big time slam. Vicious. Harsh 
Huge impact. Severe damage being inflicted to the back. What are we going to see here? Hung up on this neck breaker. What grace float over into DDT. Fight them. He paid for that one. Oh, man. Big time. Ring rattling. And the top landing. Elbow finds its mark. Most of the truly great tag teams in sports entertainment created a double team finishing maneuver. The spike pile driver from Anderson and Blanchard, the heart attack from the Heart Foundation, the rocker dropper from the Rockers, or the doomsday device from the Road Warriors. The team needs to have a tag team finisher and be able to execute that finisher on all types of opponents. Corey, a few moments ago, you mentioned some of the great tag team finishing moves in sports entertainment history. Don't forget about the 3D from the Dudley Boys or the double drop kick from the 2017 WWE Hall of Famers, the Rock and Roll Express. In tag team action, like in singles competition, once a duo nails their opponent with their finisher, that should signal the beginning of the end. It can take a long time for a tag team to decide on a double team finisher, but I agree. A team needs one, and it should be something that can be administered to any opponent. That, look at that. Oh, tear the features clean off your face. But he's running on fumes here. Does he have enough left in him to capitalize? In May of 2017, SmackDown Live saw an incredible women's tag team match when Charlotte Flair and Becky Lynch squared off against welcoming committee members Natalya and Carmella. The rivalry between these women got so intense that Naomi was in Flair and Lynch's corner and Tamina was in Natalya and Carmella's corner. I think only a group as treacherous as the welcoming committee could bring Becky Lynch and Charlotte Flair back together. Natalya's power set the tone for the match and gave her team an advantage. That was until Carmella's overconfidence let the Irish glass kicker turn the tide and get back into the match. And then it was elementary from there for the Irish-born superstar. Naomi did an excellent job of making sure any quote-unquote committee nonsense cost her girls the match. Once Becky Lynch got Carmella locked in the disarmor, there was nothing for the Staten Island Princess to do but to tap out. And it didn't take long for that to happen. There it is. The tag has been made. Oh, he needed that in the worst way, Michael. Oh, my God. Wow, driver. But he's got to capitalize now. Did you guys see the rotation? He's going for the pin. He gets his shoulder up before three. Not yet. This is going to be big, one way or another. Incoming. Comes up big with a reversal. Oh, on a close line. Forcefully delivered. Oh boy, he is rolling. Inching closer to his partner. And he tags his partner in. Momentum has certainly shifted here, Michael. Avoids trouble there. Gotta be careful not to get counted out here. 
Great job escaping, trying to turn this thing around. team match and has endured heavy amounts of punishment, they must find a way back to their corner to tag their partner. Something that they have to try is doing create separation between them and their opponent. That space gives a superstar the ability to move and catch their breath. All the way up. Oh, no. There it is. That is a game changer. That might just be the final nail. Team contest. Here's a few clips from the last match for us. These guys showed flashes in this match, but flashes don't exactly set the world on fire, as these highlights show very well. Check this out. I know the match was solidly entertaining, but I really hope these guys would take it to the next level. Regardless, nobody's asking for their money back. Here are your winners, Titter One and Titter Young, Los Matadores. Wow, huge pinfall win here tonight. I knew these two were a great team. I just didn't know how great. Wow. They really impressed me out here. Yeah, you can bet they're going to be talking about this match for quite some time. Going to be a tall order for the next match to live up to its billing. But I'm optimistic. Singles match on tap next. Making his way to the ring from Mexico, weighing in at 220 pounds, L.A. Parker. 
Guys, we have two of WWE's most exciting superstars ready to square off here. And there's nothing quite like seeing two superstars settling it in the ring in one-on-one -on -one action, Michael. And his opponent, from Mexico City, Mexico, weighing in at 206 pounds, the Superstar. Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for one-on-one -on -one action. And Michael, it sounds to me like this crowd already picked the one who they want to win this match. And we're underway. Looking at these two oh. men, I don't think there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. These guys are undoubtedly going to give us a show here Ouch. tonight. Suplex. He's starting to stumble here. Oh, man. I fully expect him to bounce back, though. This is the type of one on one atmosphere where he thrives. Yeah, but if you count him out now, guys, you'd be making Jeez. a very big mistake. Mark my words. Spinning kick to the gut. Oh my goodness, this hurts! Oh! He's looking a little weary here. You have to wonder if he could recover from this, guys. This match is trending in a bad direction for him right now, guys. Oh. He's going to want to make some changes if he wants to stay in it. He has to be disappointed in this performance. He really is so much better than what he's shown so far tonight. Kick. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Looking at it here. Unceremony. Deposit. 
buzzing it down. Victory is on the horizon. Hey, what goes up must come down. Yes! Unreal performance. Now let's take another look at these guys in action. Here is your winner, L.A. Parker. Well, that one was over before it even started. These guys look like a couple of hosses going at it out there. Great match. I think I can safely speak for all of us when I say that was an amazing contest. And now it's time for the match we've all been waiting for, our main event. Singles match coming up next. Making his way to the ring from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 250 pounds, the world heavyweight As champion. As we ready for singles action, Byron, Dan what can you tell us about Pierre. these two competitors? Oh. Well, I can say that both of these superstars come into this match incredibly hungry to prove their dominance here tonight. But as we all know, only one will walk away with their arm raised in victory.
and his opponent from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 250 pounds, the Assassin Demon. Big time singles matches on deck here. And Byron, what should we expect to see here tonight? Well, given the shape these superstars appear to be in here tonight, I fully expect to see one of the most competitive matches we've seen in a very long time. And we're underway. Looking at these two men, I don't think there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. Here we go, fellas. I've been looking forward to this one for quite some time. This might be it. Oh, my. Enough already. Right in the mouth. Oh, Relentless. Uh, enough already. Just punched him right in the mouth. Oh, Relentless. Oh, oh, man. What a stop. Good grief. Down. Like being manhandled by a bear. One fails to connect. Great idea by him. Too bad it was awfully executed, though. Shoulders on the mat. 
You can't teach the type of tenacity we're witnessing here. Unreal. There is no quit in this man tonight. Ooh, what impact. Popped up. No way. Yes way. What power. Spiked him. This one's over, guys. Here's a cover. These superstars put on quite a show. Here's another look. Yeah, this match wasn't a match that will appear on any highlight reels, but hey, it passed the time. I've got to be honest with you. I'm kind of glad that match is over. He comes out with a W, but it wasn't very pretty. Here is your winner, Dan Pierre O. Without even breaking a sweat, this one is over. This guy impressed the hell out of me tonight, Michael. What a victory. What a great night it's been. Thank you for tuning in. We'll see you next time.